Right now we're on our way to uh, UCLA to watch one of the greatest soccer team practice. And shout out to my boy Vinius. Yes, sir. You're the five. Shout out to my boy Denzi. Yes, sir. But we're gonna go check them out. They're, they're out here. Um, they're out here for like a month. And they're just practicing at UCLA. So I was able to set that up. Let's get it. this time my friends my people was like yo real madrid they're, they're practicing at ucla you gotta go check them out uh, so i was able to set this up and this is awesome to be out here it's a cool experience i was in paris watching the finals actually my first first uh, football game uh, overseas uh, it was a crazy experience just to go all the way out there and then you know to watch the boys win i, I just have so much res you know respect for the game uh, for the guys who go out there and you know my sport you know we use hands we use our feet but for them it's just all feet you know they're using head and you know, they're professionals at what they do. It's your boy Juju Smith Schuster, Kansas City Chiefs, wide receiver, Holla Madrid. Perfect. Yes, sir. Awesome, thanks a lot. Just picked up some bands, come and come again, come again. They do what I do, I'm like Simon says. Yeah, I'm the running man, rapping rubber bands, rubber bands. They do what I do, I'm like Simon says. They do what I do, I'm like Simon says. Simon says. Swerving, making plays, go for all you read. Never out my zone, touchdown in my ass. Only fam around me, I can't have no friends. Had to cut you off, you left me out for dead. We start training camp on Tuesday, and then we go our seasons from basically next Tuesday all the way up until February. Uh, yeah. Yeah, and then after that, then I'll I'll come to Spain, watch y'all boys play. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She's coming, yeah. She's coming, she's coming. Have a good time, man. Yeah. How many you guys here for? To the 31st. Oh, okay. But we like have a game on the uh, 23rd. Nice. Uh, against Barcelona in Vegas. Oh, okay. Yeah, we just uh, fly in and out. Wait, what day? Game. Oh, so Saturday, I guess. Saturday? Yeah. Oh, Saturday. I might have to fly out there. Yeah. 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 Good man, so I don't, I don't want to interrupt. Oh, you're good, you're good, you're good. Damn, I'm going to fall out to meet you, man. You okay? Yeah, I'm good, man. Bless, man. How's it going, Juju? How you doing, man? All right, yourself? Yeah, good, man. You're pre-season already? Yeah, we start training camp next week. Starting next week, Tuesday, we, oh, we go all the way up until February. And then usually right after the season, I, go, I shoot straight to uh, go and watch the football, obviously, overseas. Were you doing preseason? Yeah. So but we, where? Kansas City Chiefs. Oh, yeah. yeah. No, yeah, I know, no, no. But we do it, so we have, we, so we, Kind of like how they do it here. We do it at a, 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 a local uh, yeah. college. Always, we'll do. Boy. Spanish, Spanish. Oh, Spanish. How are you? I'm good, man. How are you guys doing, man? I'm off in my Lagos, but I think. I'm going to sign this for you. Okay. Okay. That's it. Hey, fine. Nice to meet y'all, boys, man. How do you guys like LA? Yo foto. Venga, vamos. Crazy experience, oh my god, super lit. That was awesome, bro, like, little, little towel, 
Shout out to Lil Tal, bro. Shout out to Zinni, bro. Shout out to Logic, bro. One of the best passes in the league. Yes, sir. Ready, set, go. 15, 16, 17, 18. Lot shorter. He has to do 12. He has to make 12, 18 seconds. 45 seconds rest. Yeah, 45 seconds rest because you assume two groups got to go. So you assume, you know, a bigs group and then a quarterback's group or something like that has to go. So, ready, go. Sam Plesky. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, sir. Of course. School. Pleasure, man. Thanks for being here. Nah, Carl. But first of all, let's give uh, let's give Juju a two clap. Thank you, Coach. I appreciate that. Um, man, this is awesome. Yeah, some of you guys don't know I'm half Samoan, so that's how we relate it. He, uh, he asked me to come out here and speak to you guys. Football for me has been everything. I poured my heart, sweat, blood, tears, literally into this game. Uh, football was, you know, my outcome to you know, to make it. Fortunately, I went to a school where we were really good at football. Honestly, I'll probably say I was probably like the 11th man on that team. And I worked my butt off every single day just so I can be the number one, to be the guy on top, to be the guy just to show everybody that, you know, I can make it, I still can play ball. You guys have a great, an amazing opportunity to do something special this year. Everybody got hands, everyone can run, everyone, they can do everything you guys can do. The, the thing that's going to separate you is the, the work you put in. So the, I learned this thing. So my, there's this triangle I use, right? So on this, side, on this side right here is performance. And then on this side of the triangle is hard work. The harder you pull on this side, your performance goes up like this. You guys think people like Aaron Donald, Tom Brady, like some of the greats, OBJ, like everyone you guys look up to, bro, I look up to those guys too. 10, 10, 15 years ago, I was literally sitting on my couch. I was just chilling and watching. I used to watch Big Ben. I used to watch AB. I used to watch Aaron Rodgers. You name your stars, I was the same way, just like you guys. I was literally at home watching the game, like, damn, that'd be really cool to like, actually play with them one day, or, like to even like go against them. Bro, fast forward, I'm 20, 20 years old, I'm in the huddle. And Big Ben's like, yo, like, we're gonna go win this game. So on this side, I'm pulling hard. Yeah, you guys may see the social media, the YouTube, the TikToks and all this and all that, but you know how I got there was work ethic. What you put onto the field. None of that is possible without this foundation. And then on the bottom, the base, you know what I call that? I call that the love for the game. How much do you love it? Because in this game, if you guys don't love it, if you guys bullshit, I promise you, you will get weeded out. Because when you guys go to these camps, when you guys go to all these other these events, you guys playing your game, you guys going against your teammates, your, your competition, like that is, that's just life itself. This morning, I worked out this morning, and where's Mikey at? Mikey, he got a video. I'm like, no, I don't want to do this extra. I'm tired. In my head, I'm like, I'm tired, I'm tired, I'm tired. So I go, I go back to KC Tuesday. I got a conditioning test. I got to run half gassers. I got to do 12 of them under 18 seconds. I know that I can do it. But when I get into that mode where I'm tired, I'm like, no, I don't want to do the extra rep. No, you got to do the extra rep. You got to do the extra push because I, I, when it comes down, when it's fourth and inches and fourth down and make the extra play because you're tired, it's going to pay off. And I'm telling you guys this from my experience. I just want the best from you guys. I appreciate Junior and the coaches obviously having this conversation with you guys. If you guys have any questions. How, how valuable is your walk with God? I've been, I've been up here to the point. I've been to the Pro Bowl, I juju this, juju that, juju on the beat, 
Juju Corvette, Corvette, doing all this, like you guys name it. Like, I promise you guys, man, like I've been to the top, man. Like I've, I've had the money, I, I have the cars, I have all the fancy things, but all that can be taken away from you. And I've been at the bottom. I've been at the lowest of my life this past year. I'm playing in the game. It's fourth week. I'm playing against the Broncos. I'm going to have a, a killer year. I'm about to sign a new contract. I'm about to sign a new deal. Like I, I'm about to ball out. Boom, I get hurt. Shorter comes out. And one thing I, I, I've always told Junior, I was like, damn, you know, I, when I was at the top, um, you know, I, I pray, you know, I pray. But when you're at the bottom and you feel like you're, you don't have anything, you feel like you're alone and you're like you're sad, you're by yourself, you're depressed, you pray even more. But it should never be like that. You should always pray at all times and give all your effort to God. Because without the man upstairs, ain't none of this is possible. You know, he's giving you guys the ability to play this sport. There's some people in this world who can't even get on, touch the grass to even play the sport. And you guys have a great opportunity to do that. Yeah, yeah, let's get it, let's get it. Yeah. Tell my uncle to take y'all to Dave and Buster's. <laughs> or ice cream, free ice cream. Leave him on Madden. He's not even that good, bro. He's not even nice, bro. I like that. My man, yo, what's good, everybody? It's your boy Juju, man. We are here. We got the Harbor Breeze Cruise uh, out here with the family today. Gonna have a great, great evening. Uh, pretty much my going away party before I head out to KC tomorrow. We start training camp on Tuesday, and from right there, it's a new chapter, new journey. So let's have fun tonight. Stay tuned. Be litty. Heavenly Father, we come before you this evening with a heart of gratitude, a heart of thanksgiving. Lord, we thank you for your many, many blessings, Lord. We just thank you for your favor and your hand upon the life of our son. We give you honor, praise, and glory in Jesus' name. And everyone say, Amen. As much as like, it may seem I have everything in my life, I pray so much because... All the blessings he's, he's given me, I'm able to give back to my family, my loved ones, my friends, and everyone in this boat. I know that, you know, there's times where I don't get to spend a lot of time, whether it's my my family on my, on my dad's side, my family on my mom's side. Uh, I know I'm always busy. It may seem that, like, one thing I do love to do is travel. You know, when I went to go to Jerusalem in Israel, the wall, like, it was such an eye-opening experience. Doing things that, you know, my parents, they couldn't do, and I'm trying to do things for you guys to experience like something like this tonight it just is a small gratitude to say thank you to everybody on my mom and dad's side for all the prayers and all the loves um tonight we're here together as one we're family enjoy each other's company the kids man you guys it's crazy i'm looking at everyone in here you, you guys are growing up so much um but at the end of the day like you guys mean so much to me from the bottom of my heart let's have fun have good eats good food uh just be respectful of the workers that are working here they're here to help us in any type of way. Spot, probably like a week ago, I was like, Mom, I want to get a, a lesson. I was like, I want a boat. I need everybody to wear all white. Like, we're going to have so much fun at a party because tomorrow I leave at 7 a.m. and I start my new chapter with the Kansas City Chiefs. I'm so, so excited. I can't wait. 